Hey everyone, it's Miranda. Today I'm going to be doing an acrylic painting for you guys. So, that hasn't happened in quite a while. I hope you enjoy it. I'm going to be messing around with a technique uh, with my palette knife and just laying down the background a bit and stuff. Doing lots of greens, browns, purples, you know. <laughs> it's really fun to blend on your canvas, so. Yeah, if that's what floats your boat, give it a try, because it's great. I love it, and yeah. But uh, I filmed this probably, I would say, about four months ago. I haven't shown it to you guys yet, because I painted it for my friend Liz for her wedding, and, well, obviously for her husband, too, <laughs> so yeah. But the thing is, when I went to her wedding, I forgot to bring this thing along with me, and I was like, well, that's a bummer. So, things got pretty busy, and I hadn't seen her for a while, and every time I did see her, I didn't have the painting with me, and so I didn't just want to upload this on YouTube and then have her come across the video and spoil the surprise. So that's why this is coming up four months late, but it's here, and I'm pretty happy with how this painting turned out, so I hope you guys find it peaceful and enjoyable to watch and just enjoy it in general. I like this painting a lot because before I did it I was intimidated to paint glass but since these flowers were in a mason jar I kind of had to force myself to face that fear and I have to say I'm really glad I did because it worked out really well in the end and now I really like to paint glass. So I would like to paint glass again soon. <laughs> we'll see though. But, yeah, I just, I like to do all the little glares and reflections and add little hints of color here and there. It's a lot of fun. So, if you guys feel intimidated by glass, it's okay. You can overcome it and it won't hold you back from being a good artist. I think everybody has their fears with art and it gets scary, but you can do it. So, yeah. Okay. Another thing I would like to share with you is if you haven't seen last week's video I announced some major news and that is I will be launching an Etsy store <laughs> so it took a while to get out of my mouth but anyway yeah I'm gonna be launching an Etsy store and my boyfriend was kind enough to get me a Canon PIXMA Pro 10 printer for Christmas so lots of prints are gonna be happening now and I'm very thankful for that so yeah, I thanked him for that like 50 times, and I was so shocked when I opened it. Like, he just draped a blanket over it, and I lifted it like probably 10 times. And each time I was like, are you serious? Are you serious? <laughs> so he thought that was funny. But anyway, it's either going to be launched on February 12th or the 19th. There will be original drawings and paintings in there as well as prints. So... If you want originals, you might want to, like, go to the store on the day that it opens. It's most likely going to be on February 12th. Granted, like, things run smoothly, but we'll see about that. So, yeah. But I'm not really sure how fast originals are going to sell. But these ones are going to be priced pretty fairly. So, um, yeah. But anyway, there's going to be, like, the Starbucks Girl original drawing will be there. The Pumpkin Patch one. I haven't really decided other ones, but... As far as prints go, Zafina will be in there, The Sleeper will be in there, um, My Creatures of Peace drawings, and a couple other things. So it's going to be pretty exciting, and I'm really excited because without your guys' support, this would never be happening, and so I'm super excited. Also, the first 10 people that order prints or originals or whatever from my store, I'm probably going to include some little surprise in your envelope. Just saying. So, yeah. Okay. Well, the flowers of this daisy are coming together, and you can see that I did a palette knife technique with this, and I'm not using pure white for everything. So if you look closely, you can see blues and yellows and pinks, and that's how I did that. Just wanted to go over that a little bit. But anyway, that's it for this week's video. So feel free to subscribe to me on here if you like what you see and follow me on social media. 
I will see you guys next week because I love you.